carrots. Some varieties now come in these colours. But they're mostly known for being bright orange. Hi, I'm John from Freddy and Doria Vegetable Growers. We farm baby carrots and I'm going to walk you through the process. Carrots are farmed quite widely in Australia as they grow well in a range of climatic conditions. They like soft soils that are mildly acidic to mildly alkaline and temperatures between 18 and 25 degrees. Carrots come not only in different colours but a variety of sizes and shapes. And we grow a cultivar called the Dutch Carrot. The process of producing a harvestable carrot crop begins with ground preparation. We use a rotary hoe bed former to rip and loosen up the soil to a depth of 45 centimetres. This will let the plant's roots, which are the all-important carrots, grow long and straight. The hoe also forms raised beds as it travels, which promotes good drainage and aeration of the soil. Once the ground is fully prepared, it's time to start planting the seeds. Carrot seeds, like other vegetable seeds, are pretty tiny, and depending on the variety of carrot, there can be more than 1,000 of them in a gram. We plant about 3.5 kilograms of seeds per hectare, using a seed drill to put them in the ground. Immediately after planting, the seeds are irrigated so that they have everything they need to sprout and grow. In our climate, it can take up to 21 days for the carrot seeds to germinate. That time can be reduced if the weather is really warm. We leave the tiny seedlings growing until the carrots are about 10 centimetres long. Then we fertilise them using nitrogen and potassium rich pellets. The nutrient in these pellets dissolves in water and spreads throughout the root zone, where the carrots can absorb them and supply them to their cells. Depending on what the weather does during the carrots growing time, we fertilise them once or twice more. We check the carrots regularly until they're about 15 centimetres long. Then it's time to get them out the ground. Harvesting is done by hand and involves pulling up the carrots and putting them into tubs. It's important to pick the carrots early in the day when the soil is still moist, otherwise they're very hard to wash. If left in the ground, these carrots will grow to full size, but Dutch carrots have been specially bred to be harvested young, when they're still tender and sweet. Let's get the carrots back to the packing shed. In here, the carrots are thoroughly washed before they're packed into either boxes or crates. They are then kept in a cool room at 2.4 degrees Celsius as they wait to be transported across the country by trucks. So, from plain little seeds to these bright orange babies, that's the carrot farming process.